How are we doing this evening, Kent County? No, really, the state of West Michigan's most populated county can be indicative of how the rest of the region and even state is faring. So let's check in. New tonight, our Olivia Tuma reports after attending the annual State of the County address this evening. Fill us in. Yeah, Samantha, Kent County Board of Commissioners Chair Stan Steck and County Administrator Al Vanderberg presented initiatives that the county has been working towards over the last 12 months to meet the needs of the community. We're committed to making sure that all of the services that we provide are done with excellence, are done innovatively, and done as efficiently as we can. The first main topic discussed this evening, what Kent County has done to transform crisis response services. The Crisis Center Task Force was created and began to look at how, how can we change from the ground up what we do in addressing these crises. Steck says that the crisis response services are intended to provide the right services at the right time and at the right cost. Our drop-off time is down to six minutes. The second topic, how the county is addressing a new means of solid waste. The big thing is to not have another landfill in the county. Steck tells me that their goal is to reduce what they put into landfill by 90%. The final topic, some of the new projects being developed across the community. Both projects, the soccer stadium and the amphitheater will create a, a tremendous amount of investment and also jobs and uh, will have a big boost to our local economy. What Steck wants you to take away from tonight's state of the county. They know that they live in the best county in the state. For questions or feedback on the state of the county, head to our website at fox17online.com. In studio, Olivia Yatuma, Fox 17 News.